come back. We are currently at war, and our next objective is to invade Prim's castle and defeat Prim. So, let's go do that. We'll, we'll, we'll see if we can end this war. Something's going to go wrong, because we know what the game is, don't we? We know what the game is. Hmm. Tips 19. Welcome, Vice Ritter. Now this place has, has really, really got a problem with her, like plants and stuff. She's just let everything grow everywhere. It's terrible. Prim, you have no idea how long I've been waiting for this. About mm, five months. <laughs> and I've been waiting for you. It's taken me three years to prepare this stage for you. What are you talking about? Your Lord Theodore is quite the patient man. After three years of being worn down by Madame Prim, he was able to assemble this impressive fighting force. Remarkable, given the circumstances. Yes, yes, it is quite good, isn't it? Fighting Isabel, fighting me, making your organization strong. Even with the power of premonition, his abilities appear to be... unnatural. Ha! Huh. That's because Lord Theodore is stronger than any witch! Yeah, but... how and why? But his resourcefulness will be his downfall. Isabel's defeat lit a fire in the Vice Ritter. All of his preparations and caution were for naught. As soon as the first blood was spilled, Isabel's death made you arrogant and overconfident. Theodore rushed into this engagement without ample time to prepare. I merely had to place a trap in Grenza Village, and you all took the bait like a pack of starved wolves. You're talking as if this was all part of your plan. All according to Cake for Two. it was. I created just enough obstacles for you to not realize that I was leading you to a place where Theodora cannot reach. It did require sacrifice, but that was a small price to pay to gather all of the Holy Valkyries in one place. I mean, it was clearly a trap. Several times. Now, let us begin. Let the red roses of blood bloom. Ring the starting bell. ding a -ling? She underestimates us. Ugh! What is happening? Every day since you scarred my body, I've been training, studying, suffering in my shameful defeat. I no longer f let me show you what I've learned. Whoops. She no longer fears death, anyway. Don't you dare underestimate my love for Lord Theodore! And I take pride in fulfilling my duty. <laughs> Madam Prim! Oh no, this is bad. This is really, really bad. Yeah, kinda. For you, anyway. Oh my! If it isn't Addis, long time no see, how are you? Why, it's Lady Lisa! Hello! I'm doing very well, as you can see. Oh, so you're doing well, are you? See, hearing Eric, is it, all I can think is right now is like... We won't hear Oscar. In Atelier, because they decided not to dub it. It was just like, oh. I never know what happened with every situation now, like, like what happened with Sophie. Yeah. Oh, well. Why is someone who betrayed Lord Theodore doing well, though? I know what you need. A powerful, painful viral infection. I'll just inject that into you right now, so don't you move a muscle, okay? 
I mean, he's not exactly going to go like, oh, yeah, go ahead. What? Why do you think he would? Get away from me, vile woman! Madam Prim, help me! What an annoying whine. Who told you you could stop, huh? You've certainly earned your reputation, Prim. She has a reputation? And you've earned yours. Of all these women, only you have truly earned the title of Valkyrie. Madam Prim! You're okay! Oh, I'm so relieved. You're okay? What was your dumb ass doing while I was fighting, Addis? Do you want to have a little chat, huh? A nice picnic? I almost got nicked by an attack because of you, you shit-eating worm! Ow! Sorry! Sorry! Please stop kicking me! I already got enough shit to deal with today! Your subpar performance and all of the holy Valkyries! I didn't think I'd have to do this before my fight with the little imp. Isabel's witch is tear, madam. It's, it's, it's like, why didn't they question who the imp was, but all right. Maybe they will. Thank you, Chidori. A magic crystal? What are you going to do with that? This. Prim casually tossed the large crystal into her mouth and swallowed it in a single gulp. Her throat bulged out as the crystal sank into her stomach. Oh, ugh. even when I close my rose, that tastes awful. Just what in the hell are you doing? Oh, <laughs> you don't know. A witch's third eye contains immense power. A Venefica's third eye is even more powerful. Though I will admit karma is stronger still. And by consuming that eye, now do you understand? Uh, you've got more magic? It can't be. <laughs> Your attention, please. Witness my true power. She's so strong. She's not even touching me, and I feel like I'm about to fall over. That, you might just be feeling faint or something like that. Maybe it's a bit too warm in here. Don't let her intimidate you. Push forward. <laughs> Die. It's time for the Hundred Knight to appear. still standing. Three years ago, I had you on all fours, tossing you about like a rag doll. Is this karma's doing? Or has Theodore's alchemy improved over the years? I suppose it hardly matters. I will grind you into dust regardless. It's over for you. Now, who's left? You. I won't let you escape again. Like, where is the Hundred Knight? He, need, he needs to be here. N no! Milm! Hundred Knight! <laughs> so, you've chosen to stand against me after all. I mean, what else was I gonna do? If only you had joined me, you wouldn't have to die like this. I, I mean, I could say the same, I suppose. But so be it. Very well. Just as I promised, I will give you a death of crimson. A rouge of your own blood. A rouge? Very well. All right, so let's see. What are we now, sir? Yeah, with swords. Okay, okay. Just wanna see. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Let's go with these guys for now. So we got things going on there. 
Let's let's try and get close. Go Mystic Dodge. We got rid of them. Come on. It says ineffective, so... I honestly don't think magic is going to work that well, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> I do feel like this is probably the best doing that. So that is taking quite a bit of damage. It says weakness, but ineffective at the same time. It feels strange. Very, very, very strange. It's like, just come back here. It's like, let's heal up. Come around. I need to get rid of these little guys, really, don't I? They're the problem. Right, Stop being like just that little bit away from me. I need to be closer. Just stop it. Come closer and closer and burn. I really do need that mystic dodge, don't I? What is what is she doing? It's like I'm just accepting damage though, aren't I? It's not even like I'm trying to dodge what those little guys are doing. I'm just accepting the damage that's coming my way, which is kind of wrong. Like, oh, back off, back off, back off, back off, back off. I do. Restores Giga Cows. It's the garlic I need. Uh, heal up, use that. Good. These little guys were, I guess, annoying. There we go, there we go. Go for the Mystic Dodge again. We'll actually get the triangle going as well. So we'll do that. I expect her to just stay nearby as well when that was happening. Almost got her, almost got her. Basically, I'm not putting any tactics properly into this at all, am I? It's basically, because I've leveled up enough, I'm just brute forcing it. It's like, what are you doing? Dear God. I can't move properly. Oh, I was hoping that would finish her off. There we go. We got her. Finally, we got her. Lovely. A jubbly. Defeated. Krim. Could have done it better. Could have done it better. Stage clear. Nothing. Nothing at all. Uh, I cannot believe. Madam Prim. <laughs> I'm out of here. Jesus, Eric. Halt! Come any closer to Madame Prim, and my beak will find its way into this girl's brain. Now, Madame Prim, destroy that worm of a Manania. You did well, Chidori. This is just cheap. I believe that you have seen this once before. I can change those who touch my skin into many, many things. With my right hand, I could turn you into a seed, and my left could turn you to water. My left foot could turn you into a worm. Yeah, and your right foot? Now, which would you prefer? Perhaps you'd rather just be manure. Hundred Knight! 
What? It's gotta be Chelka. It's gotta be. <laughs> Looks like you got the fun started without me. Been so long since I heard Chelka. Who are you? <laughs> Manania wants to know my name. Fine. My name is Chelka. A name that you will come to fear. I have awakened from a deep slumber, and I have come to claim my rightful power! An awakened witch? I've never heard of you, though your scent is familiar. Did you come here for the girl? In that case, I would avoid doing anything too hasty. Her life is in my hands now. Chelka? Did you come to save me? What? Wait, you're a hostage right now? Seriously? Seriously. <laughs> oh man, that's too rich! Good job, Manania! You should just kill her right now! I don't know what I expected. Ah, so she is not your ally then. Well, in any case, do not take a single step closer to Madame Prim. Prim? Oh, you mean her? I warned you! Are you threatening me, bird brain? Know your role, Jeeves. Chidori! I'll kill you! So this is all the most powerful witch in the world has to offer. Come on, I just woke up. Make me work for it a little. Really? That? All right, then. You mustn't. Madam Prim, please, stay awake. You'll turn feral. Chidori, I can't. It's all right, Madam Prim. For the boundless affection that you've shown me these many years, I shall return the favor. A small mote of magical power flew from Chidori's heart and made its way to Prim's, sustaining her life. Chidori's body went stiff, his vibrant plumage fading to grey. He fell lifeless to the floor. Chidori... <clears throat> what is this? I feel all gross inside my chest. Uh, probably indigestion. I don't know, it depends. Did you eat anything recently? Well, that's the only way to find out. This is all your fault. With tears in her eyes, Prim clutched a handful of gravel and threw it pitifully at Chelka. Ow! Seriously, who throws gravel? What is this? Blood. My head. Shelka? What is this feeling? It, it's like a tingling. Throbbing. I can't describe it. Shelka, are you in pain? Pain? Is that what this is? I don't know. I think so. Pain. I feel like... crying. <laughs> it hurts! It really hurts! It hurts! That isn't good. Gonna guess end of chapter? Oh no. Oh, alright then. 
<laughs> you destroyed the castle? Alright. The castle, it's gone. Yet we're still here, like, hunky-dory. Alright then. Huh? How am I still alive? It's the will of Stein's Gate. Everyone's still alive. Even Prim. Damn it! It won't go away! Could Chelka have... <laughs> hey, obnoxious cow. Come here. What? What is this? The basement. Hmm. <laughs> this looks interesting. Ah! Wait, Chalka! Wait for me! Okay, huh? Is this a research lab? What in the world? Oh. It is sort of like, well, that kind of makes sense. Like, the Castle Warian has a research lab, so... <laughs> there must have been a lot of pain inflicted here. Is this Prim's work? Nope. Look closer. All of the tools and bottles and junk have the same symbol on them. I was gonna say, there's a vice Richter symbol on that bottle over to the left, so... Vice Ritter? Thank you? <gasps> what? What does that mean? Chapter 6? The Witch and the Inquisition. Actually, I think we shall end this part here, then. In the next part, we'll go on and see Chapter 7. Ta-ta for now.